Now, I'm, I'm blessed, man. I've, I've been doing martial arts since I'm five years old, and you know, it just uh, doesn't make me better as a manager, or it just I think it makes me better as a person. Uh, it's just uh, discipline a little bit, it make me humble, and honestly, it, it, it does help me. It does help me in a way I feel what they feel. I, uh, you know, when you, when you share a dinner table, is great. When you share an airplane, it's great. When you share a car seat, but when you share blood and sweat and tears together, you have this dude breathing down your neck and he breathing down the neck. It's a, it's a completely different bond. Morning, shoe shop. What was your, your last official fight? What year? Uh, I was uh, 19, so 23 years ago. Damn. Now I got like this. If I was to be fighting, I had to chase him. I'm like, he's that you. It's a sponge, man. I mean, every time we get in there, it's telling him to do one thing one time, and he does it over and over. Can't ask for much more out of a fighter. I mean, the biggest thing with him was having, you know, a structure. Right, and that's what, the, what he came to me for, having something in place, having something consistent. I mean, he always had a desire, he always had the drive. Now he has that structure and that consistency. And that's the one thing that he always talks about. And for him to be able to accomplish that, he had to have a high level of discipline, which he has. So, I mean, it just went hand in hand. Three, one, two, three, buddy. Left, front, left. Good, double drop. Pull in two. Pull in two. Double drop. Ball. Oh, come forward, come forward. When I come forward, double drop. Boom, ball. Boom, right up. Boom, right hand. Don't move back, steady this way. Double drop. Boom, here. Nice, good. No, no, Ali, Ali go hard. 
Here we go, Ty. Oh, yeah, he goes hard, bro. Pete Pulester? Yeah. No, we want to fuck around. But Pete Pulester? Yeah. Hell yeah. He's here to fuck me up. Yeah, that's we're here to get fucked up. It's our peak week. I'm first with Pete Pulester. I'm not here to win. We win tonight in the fight. Yeah, I fight 50 minutes out there. 50 minutes here. Five minutes, five minutes, five minutes. Word of mouth. You really will not, you have to do it to understand it. And uh, it's just a completely different bound and it's completely different love. It's, it's a, you're giving each other, you know, you're punching each other in the face or try to choke each other out. This is love. In a way, it is love. It's violent, but in a way, you try to be the best you can, they try to be the best you can. Stand up, stand up. Up on the pitch. <laughs> Anatomy of the fighter. What up? Ali said he wasn't getting taken down. Seen him get taken down like five times, six maybe. This guy. Sometimes I go there and these guys, you know, try to beat me up and I will try to get back at them and it's just that. Uh, but at the end of the day, when you're done with this round or the five minute, you look at each other and smile and you enjoy the moment of joy. It's that safe, man. It's just, uh, I'm just, we all blessed to do what we love. My, they ask me what's my name, it's Otman. It's not easy to, to spell, but I use also Superman. You can use Batman, Ant-Man, like any hero. But I love Batman the most.
Yeah, my eyes are all fucked up, so gotta keep some ice on them so it don't get too swollen. Don't wanna spread no infections. Oh, oh, hey guys, yeah, lock it up, eat those, thank you. Five minute guys, I'm gonna grab four rounds. Don't touch this. Thank you for letting me do that, yeah. Huh? <laughs> It's just good energy, good energy, good, good, good people, good souls, and we're all working for one thing, and that's just to be the best fighters in the world. So, anytime you get around guys like that that genuinely love to help each other out, it's uh, it's very special. And it's uh, it's humbling, it's humbling too, because there are certain positions that you get caught in, and then it's it's uh, it's special to just say, hey, what did you what did you catch me? And they show you. And, and you learn, and that's ultimately how to become a better martial artist. Honestly, at first, when you're younger, you, you get kind of like discouraged because, like, even wrestling, you get taken down in practice. You used to like bug me so bad, and it's still like, of course, I'm competitive. But now that you get older, you have to really, really realize that it's it is just practice, and you want to be the best in practice. But at the end of the day, if you don't open up and you don't try different moves and you don't put yourself in certain positions, you'll never really. Uh, really learn anything and it's so like people say it so much is like like once it's hard to really explain but if you've never put yourself in bad positions you'll never really understand uh, you know, how to get out of it because in a fight you are going to be in bad positions it's not a matter of if it's just when and like you said they say keep your ego at the door that's basically what you do you come in you say okay if I get tapped out three times today with those three taps or submissions I'm going to figure out what I did wrong and it's freeing once you let that go you can come into practice and, and enjoy it so much more for me personally for me it's a big 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 opportunity to fight in the same card with Khabib Khabib Nurmagomedov is like one of the most famous sportsmen in the world and I love this guy I appreciate him he did a lot uh, big things for the sport and he did he do, he do a lot of great things therefore I appreciate him in my mind I think this guy this guy can become once like Muhammad Ali and therefore I respect him and I love him and it's uh, very I appreciate to be in the same cartoon like him and especially that's in one Arab country you know all the Arab people I am Moroccan all my people gonna watch this fight close to them have the possibility like to fly it only five hours to Abu Dhabi not uh, if it were in uh, Vegas it will be also fine they gonna watch it anyway but they won't take like 18 hours flight so this is like very easy for all my friends all my family from uh, Morocco and my friends from Germany and French and Italy I have everywhere in the world friends and that's very easy for them to come to Abu Dhabi.